Number 5. Asus TUF Gaming FX505 GT As far as gaming laptops go, the Asus TUF Gaming FX505 GT series offers a nice blend of features and performance, while sacrificing on areas like build quality and portability for the sake of keeping prices down. Compromises must be made in order to make these devices attractive to users on a budget. Asus TUF FX505 GT BI5N7 is a 15.6-inch modern gaming laptop as part of the FX series with a full HD display, a 9th generation Intel i5 processor, GTX 1650 dedicated graphics card, a large 512GB solid-state drive, 8GB of memory, Windows 10 Home 64-bit, RGB backlit keyboard and a number of modern ports that'll come in handy. The Nano Edge display has the very thin 6.5mm bezel to offer you a more immersive experience. It offers the theatre quality high fidelity immersive 7.1 channel virtual surround sound and the webcam on top of the display is the HD 720p CMOS module which is great for Skype chats, gaming with mates and more. Quarter 2 of 2019 release Intel i5-9300H processing runs at speeds between 2.4GHz and 4.1GHz with the Intel Turbo Boost technology. You have the dynamic additional performance as needed and will switch back to the base speed to improve the energy efficiency. It's built very sturdy with a military-grade mil-standard 810G. It's tough and durable, weighs 4.85 pounds and measures 14.2 by 10.3 by 1.1 inches. It has a desktop-inspired RGB backlit keyboard for seeing better in the dark or dim light and has the hyper-strike technology for better ergonomics and accurate typing with a 1.8mm key travel. Connectivity options include the 802.11ac wireless, Bluetooth 5.0 and RJ45 LAN jack for a LAN insert, USB 2.0 port, two USB 3.1 Gen 1 Type-A ports, a combo audio jack and an HDMI 2.0 output. With the new Asus TUF FX505 GT, you will enjoy a powerful gaming experience at a relatively low price. We're more than happy to recommend it to those gamers on the budget. Number 4. Acer Nitro 5 Acer Nitro 5 is one of the best budget gaming laptops you can find out there. It might be a little bit old by today's standards, but it can still run most of the modern AAA games in full HD settings with great frame rates. It might not have the most interesting design or something of a similar nature, but it's an all-star without a doubt. Let's check it out. In the design and aesthetics perspective, like I said, the Acer Nitro 5 is not the most streamlined or sleekest device. It's also pretty substantial at 5.4 pounds in total and measures about an inch at its thickest. It has a brushed aluminium design that gives it a bit of a classier look compared to the rest of the body. On the front side, the Acer Nitro 5 is packed with a 15.6-inch 1920x1080p display that's pretty sharp overall and emits good colours. I found it a little dim compared to the average, but you probably won't use it under direct sunlight. The in-plane switching panel has some good wide viewing angles, and without forgetting, I should state that the keyboard is rather snappy with good key travel and a clicky feeling. The trackpad is mediocre at best, but has a nice size. Now we're coming to the main selling point of the laptop, the performance. It's one of the most impressive I've ever seen at this price. It's great for gaming, productivity and even some graphical work as well. It can run all contemporary AAA games with at least 30 frames per second at full HD with impressive settings. It does that based on the Intel Core i5-7300HQ CPU, 8GB of RAM and 256GB of high-speed SSD. In addition to that, it's armed with an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1050 Ti with 4GB of dedicated VRAM that's rather powerful for its price. Number 1. Asus ROG G531 GT for those that are always looking for the best deals and to get the most for their hard-earned money, I have the Asus ROG G531 GT. This power-packed gaming laptop will keep you satisfied with its amazing specs, decent display, interesting design and promise to run all the recent titles in 1080p with superb frame rates. Definitely a great package. It's worth your time and money for sure. The Asus ROG G531 GT is a device that's from the Asus Republic of Gamers Strix Scar series, and just like every laptop in that series, it has the design to go along with it. It has a polycarbonate body that feels pretty sturdy overall, and on the lid it has a two-tone brushed metal finish that goes hand-in-hand -hand with a carbon fibre print and the ROG logo that looks perfect back there. I also saw that the bezels around the screen looked perfect as they're pretty slim. On the bottom, the company has equipped this device with 3D Flow Zone, which does a great deal of help when it comes to ventilation. 
On the front side, it packs a 15.6-inch LED backlit Full HD 1920x1080p resolution display, which delivered plenty of sharpness overall, and moving and it also delivers some good colour reproduction and brightness, but overall it's not a great panel for watching movies or doing some design work, but for gaming, it's adequate. I should mention that the keyboard felt pretty good overall as it delivered a great performance for both gaming and typing, with good travel and soft finish upon them. However, the Asus ROG G531GT is not just a pretty face as it's packed with performance for ages. First, I have to mention the 9th generation Intel Core i7-9750H processor that goes along with 8GB of RAM and 512GB of SSD to deliver amazing productivity and multitasking for your daily use. However, that will be combined excellently with the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650 graphics unit with 4GB of dedicated VRAM to deliver a great gaming prowess with smooth frame rates and stunning visuals. A beast worth giving a try, the Asus ROG G531GT will deliver a perfect gaming experience without asking for much. Number 2. Lenovo Legion 5 Lenovo's Legion family of laptops are among the best gaming-specific machines to buy. This Legion 5 on sale packs a 15.6-inch display, 1920x1080, a 2.9GHz AMD Ryzen 7-4800H octa-core CPU, 8GB of RAM, a 512GB SSD, and a GTX 1650 GPU with 4GB of graphics memory. You can expect this Ryzen 74800H charged Legion 5 to outperform competing Intel gaming laptops. In a recent benchmark face-off, the Ryzen 7 4000 series CPU wiped the floor with Intel's 11th generation Tiger Lake processor. That said, the Legion 5 can handle even the most demanding everyday tasks when you're not gaming. The Legion 5 is entirely built out of plastic and it hasn't changed much in terms of design language from the previous Legion Wi-Fi 40 generation. The build quality is pretty solid with a well-made screen and limited flex in the main deck. A smooth kind of plastic is used for the lid, a rougher kind for the bottom, and a rubbery coated one for the interior, but they blend well together and actually do a good job of fending off smudges and finger oil. As far as practicality goes, this Legion 5 raises the bar high for other manufacturers. First off, Lenovo put some large and very grippy rubber feet on the bottom that do an excellent job at keeping this anchored on the desk. The Legion 5 is the highest spec variant available as of right now, with a Ryzen 7 4800H processor, 16GB of DDR4 RAM, 3200MHz in dual channel, 512GB of SSD storage and dual graphics, the NVIDIA GTX 1650D GPU and the Radeon Vega iGPU within the AMD platform and the ability to seamlessly commute between them based on load. You can disable the Vega GPU from the Vantage app by disabling hybrid mode, and that links the internal display straight to the NVIDIA GPU, minimizing input lag. There's a complex thermal module on this Legion 5 with two fans, four radiators, three heat pipes, and ample thermal plates on top of the CPU, GPU, and VRMs. This is further complemented by proper intakes and exhausts, so Lenovo didn't skimp on the thermal design here, not even on this lower GPU configuration. The laptop comes with a compact and fairly light 170-watt charger that plugs in via their proprietary rectangular plug. A full charge takes about two hours if you enable quick charging from the Vantage app, or two plus hours otherwise. USB-C charging is not supported, and it can last for up to 11 hours. So, if you're looking for an affordable gaming laptop for under $1,000, we recommend you jump on this excellent Legion 5 deal. Number 1. MSI GF65 Thin 9SD252 As our top pick, we have the MSI GF65 Thin 9SD252. The combination of plastic and aluminium body panel doesn't really make it stand out from the crowd, but it serves its purpose well. The ports are mostly located on the right side of the laptop. We appreciate the thought of placing the charging port and HDMI on the left side. Still, plugging in USB devices would indirectly get in the way of your mouse movement. MSI has interestingly included two USB-C ports on the GF65 Thin, which is a rare occasion when it comes to laptops of this price range. On that side note, the USB-A port has been reduced to just two, which might be a problem for some who wish to use keyboard, mouse and external storage at the same time. Nonetheless, we're happy to see that MSI is embracing the future and taking a step towards USB-C everything. Opening the lid reveals the 15.6-inch Full HD display with narrow slide bezels. MSI has kept the design conventional with a top webcam and microphone placement. In terms of the panel performance, the one we have is rocking a 120Hz high refresh rate display. 
MSI Marketing never boasts any of those color accuracy statistics nor anything about its display. We're not entirely sure why, but from our user experience, it's a decent panel with good viewing angle and color reproduction. The actual gaming experience is pretty decent. The Intel Core i5-9300H and NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1660 Ti pairs up nicely without causing any major bottlenecking to each other. Sure, some may question why we need a 120Hz display when the GPU is struggling to push out 75fps in most of our tests. You're getting a lot of gaming power from the MSI GF65 GTX 1660 Ti for under $1,000, especially when you consider that slower GTX 1060 laptops launched at even higher prices. Buying Guide Firstly, Graphics the graphics card or GPU is the keystone of your gaming laptop. It delivers the images on your display by processing the data and transmitting the signal to the monitor. Due to how stressful this process can be when running games, you need a discrete GPU with its own dedicated memory called VRAM or video memory. Although there tends to be a more is better mantra with gaming PCs, the average gaming enthusiast should be okay with 4GB of VRAM. The majority of gaming laptops ship with NVIDIA GPUs, but if you're partial to AMD, there are certain brands that allow you to configure your system accordingly. Secondly, display. The minimum resolution for any gaming laptop is 1920 by 1080 anything less and you're asking for muddy graphics. Laptops with QHD 2560 by 1440 or 4K 3840 by 2160 panels are becoming increasingly popular, praised for their striking details and colour. There are some gamers that swear by 1366 by 768 because of the increased frame rates, but I implore you to love yourself more and aim a bit higher. Number 3. RAM and CPU If the GPU is the heart of a gaming laptop, then the processor and RAM are the brain and hippocampus. Your laptop's processor, CPU, handles everything that doesn't have to do with graphics, such as performing some of a game's physics calculations and controlling its non-playable characters. It also affects the performance of all your non-gaming applications, including your browser, OS, and productivity apps.